big stage. They play that as they walk off to get a drink of water that's always 40 feet away. But here it's right here, so what the hell. Anyway. We'll play it. Yeah, they play it anyway, and I told them, I mean, let them earn the money, you know. <laughs> I remember of 802 in New York, so it's okay. You don't have to applaud for that. Just let it accumulate. <laughs> I didn't rehearse anything there. Just fooling around. But I, I thought it would be fun, you know, what's a show without playing at least a little harmonic at least once or twice. Uh, you know, it just don't happen that way. So I thought I would demonstrate some of the different things you can do on the little tiny harmonica. And... Uh, it can swing a little bit, shuffle, or whatever you want. So let's try one. And yeah. Save it up till the end, then wham. And you know, you always see soloists doing the Carnival of Venice, and they do all this. You can do it on this. And uh, just let's do it. Not yet, save it. <laughs> uh, okay, if you want to be my guest. Uh, and uh, did you ever see a harmonic act where they did not do the 12th Street drag? So in deference to all the other harmonica players who play the 12th Street drag, I will do it too. You should have said something, I would have played it sooner. <laughs> Going from the ridiculous to something even more so, I brought this along. This is called a melodica. Looks a little like the right hand of an accordion. It's not a harmonica, it's made by Hona.
see, and it sounds like an accordion. And that's why I learned to play it. I became angry with accordion players because they would come out to a group such as yourselves. They'd come out, they'd play something relatively simple. Then they'd sa start to shake the bellows. You've all seen them do that, I know. And the audience bursts into frenetic applause, and it's all a big fake. You don't need an accordion. You can do it on this. <laughs> and they always play Lady of Spain. Am I right? As a matter of fact, I've got to tell you this story. I heard the story of the accordion player who walked into a bank with his accordion. He walked right up to the teller. He said, give me all your money or I'll play Lady of Spain. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good musician too. <laughs> so what do you think I'm going to play? <laughs> oh, I forgot to tell you. When I get to that shaky part and I have an intellectual group out front, they burst into spontaneous applause. <laughs> I'll tell you when. <laughs> Take no chances. <laughs> This next tune comes from way back in the 30s. Uh, you all remember it. You remember it? Yeah, one day is done. I, I made a little classical arrangement of this old tune. In this number, we use every trick on the harmonica, perhaps shimmering violins. You know, all that harp. All those kind of things. And I leave it to your imagination, whether I'm doing an organ or a nobo or whatever, I leave it to your imagination. But we use everything, and in the second chorus on this, we simulate a whole brass section playing full, full chords, you know? So here it is. <laughs> <laughs> 